First of all, Greg, um, not going to be there this Sunday, unlike last year. Um, thoughts on the season? Oh, it's very inconsistent, there's no doubt about it. And if you go back and look at you know, the, the way we played, wasn't our brand of footy. And, um, you know, we, we sat down and had a chat, chat about it um, after we bowed out of the finals. And, you know, at the end of the day, it just wasn't good enough. And it wasn't, you know, what nowhere near as capable it was um, uh, throughout the season. First year as club captain, how would you find that? Yeah, look, it definitely has challenges along the way, and I've, I've said that before, but, you know, I've learnt, I learnt, learnt about it, and the best thing about, the, about it is you can move forward and taking these challenges with you. Have you, um, have you been following Jared Haynes' progress in the NFL? No, no, not, not really, mate. Um, you know, um, had all two for going over there and doing, doing what nobody thought he could, but... Uh, you know, no, I haven't really been following him at all. Um, been touted early on as like possible AFL convert, NFL convert. Has that ever crossed your mind? Any sort of like NFL taking up a challenge like that? No, I, I think I think what makes it so unique is Jared's got the passion for it. You know, I admire what the guys do. I admire you know all professional athletes and what they do. And unless you do the sport and really know understand it, um, then you can't really bag you know bag bag the sporting. Uh, but what, like I said, what Jared's done, he, he's, he's so passionate about it. He went over and lived his dream and he's doing, doing what he set out to done.